copying happens in our daily lives in ways we don't even think about. Every time we email, every time we take a picture, send it online, we're using copyrighted material and we're taking past knowledge and trying to develop a better understanding of our world, trying to teach each other, trying to actually create better services and products. Eli Lehrer, the R Street Institute. Gene Kimmelman, I'm President and CEO of Public Knowledge. My name is Katie Bowers and I work for the Harry Potter Alliance. Cory Doctorow and I'm a special consultant to the Electronic Frontier Foundation. It's all about bringing copyright law into the digital age. The internet makes it possible to share things in a way that they have never been shared before. And to realize its full potential, all of that knowledge must be accessible and available. One of the important things for helping copyright to protect creators is really making it very accessible, especially for creators who are not a part of large corporations. The Recreate Coalition is working for a return to sensible constitutional copyright for copyright the way the founders intended it to be. Historically, what copyright has done to figure out whether or not you fell in those rules is to check whether you are making or handling copies of works. What happened, though, was that with the advent of the internet and mass digitization, now everybody makes and handles copies of works a thousand times a day. And that's what this coalition has come together around, updating laws for the digital age so that we can use copyright not just to build monopolies and drive up prices, but to use copyright law so that we take knowledge and we expand knowledge. This does not mean that creators should not be able to get their rights. This does not mean that creators should not be able to make profits. It does mean that at some point, things ought to be freely accessible on the internet. We could adjust the statutory damages for copyright infringement, increase the flexibility of the limitations on copyright. We're looking for a really strong balance that helps creators be recognized and compensated and also fans and innovators to take material and do things that are new and exciting and that help keep creativity and progress going.